All right, our team coverage continues right now with more from the West Wichita neighborhood awakened by gunshots. Cake's Jordan Shefty has their reaction. An early morning police chase ended right here at Maple and Mount Carmel. Police have been investigating the area throughout the morning. Those evidence markers indicate the spot where an officer involved shooting turned deadly. He flagged me down. I asked him who it was. Took off on me. Sorry. Scanner traffic shines insight on what started this whole ordeal. Police become involved in a chase with a suspect. No traffic. Going about 75. 40 mile an hour zone. He's got a surefire flashlight and he's trying to strobe it to obstruct my vision. The suspect vehicle, this red Monte Carlo, came to a stop at Maple and Mount Carmel. A confrontation followed, and that's when the situation turned deadly. Shot fired, shot fired. It was shot fired. Out of nowhere at 2.30 in the morning, I heard like about five or six gunshots. And I look outside my window and all I, all I see is cops running. I didn't want there to be more firing. I was afraid to look out even and see what was going on. Just steps away from where the shooting happened, Tammy Thomas says her family heard the whole thing. We woke up and to gunfire and we thought, I thought, God, it sounded like maybe fireworks. And then my husband go, no, that's, that's bullets. So we looked out our top bedroom window and just seeing cops everywhere. Police spent the morning investigating using flashlights to see in the dark several evidence markers cover the street. Officers checking in on nearby homes to make sure no one else was injured. A policeman came by and said that it was okay but the gunshots had been fired in the direction of my house. So I was concerned. I was a little worried. Neighbors hoping this is the last time they see their street as a crime scene. I just hope everything gets over with and nothing like this ever happens again around here. Jordan Shafty, Cake News.